Benjamin, on the count of three, throw the toy to the cat. One, two, three. Yeah. <laughs> A plan. I have a plan. We go home? No, not before we get the cat back to the garden. And don't forget, we have to get the sprouts. I know. We need some string, which luckily I carry with me, just in case. And we'll need the cat toy, Cottontail. Uh, what is she doing? No idea. Ready, boys? Ready. OK, Cat, back to the garden you go! for a while, my love. But... Uh, I'm hibernating, sleeping all winter. Oh, come back in the spring. But, Mrs Tiggy... Oh, so sleepy. Now, Peter, be a dear and run along. Oh. No, you don't understand. 
Better. We need to keep this burrow nice and warm. Ready? Let's go. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Come on out and play, Benjamin. It's snowball weather. <gasps> uh, no can do, Peter. We're on our way to the Aww. shop. I'm completely out of cogs, wheel nuts and quarter-inch springs. Unless you happen to have any. Uh, no. Sorry, Uncle Bouncer. Please, 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 can I play in the snow, Dad? Uh, oh, all right. Oh. <laughs> oh, gosh, it's cold today. Don't stay out too long. Have fun now. <laughs> <gasps> wow! This hill is just begging to be slid down. How about we use this? And it's big enough for all three of us. Yeah! Throwing snow at me! Tommy Brock! Quick, hide! Ugh, too cold to sleep. Oh, I can't stand snow. Oh, oh not even a flea to munch neither. Now, what I need is somewhere cozy and warm with a big bucket of juicy worms to fill my tummy. Tommy Brock's grumpy today. Mr Todd wouldn't let him into his house earlier. Why would he want to go in there? To warm up, I suppose. Anyway, he's gone. Hey, let's build a snow bunny. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh, hello. A chimney. Oh, now that looks warm. <laughs> Oh, 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 ow. <laughs> hey? Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 oh, that's better. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Hi, Dad. Uh, uh, Ouch! He's been doing that all morning. Wow! Do it again, Uncle. Peter. Oh, poor Mr. Bouncer. You're in no state to go trudging about in the snow. Uh, uh, Here he goes again! Uh, uh, oh. 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 False alarm. We'll just have to find someone else to fetch our food from the shop. I'll do it. Oh, I would do it myself, but I really need I'll to do stay it. here and feed the young ones. Not to mention stoke the fires. I'll do it! And you'll need plenty of warm soup before that chill gets to your chest. Oh! I said I'll do it. You, Peter? Why not? I'm the fastest, I know the woods inside out, and I'm back to front. Please, Mum, let's go home and get the sledge. Let me make the Christmas deliveries. This is a list of all the food you need to buy at Ginger and Pickles' shop. You mustn't lose it. Understood? Don't lose the list. Got it. And watch out for that sneaky fox, Mr Todd. He'd like nothing more than to catch a rabbit for his Christmas dinner. Watch out for the fox. I can do that. Listen to me, darling. This is the most important job you've ever had. If you don't deliver that food, we'll all go hungry this Christmas. You must go straight to the shop. Everyone is depending on you. You can count on me, Mum. Oh, dear me, you've grown so much since last winter. Hmm, wait here. I think the one your father wore will do. Wow! Dad's jacket! A perfect fit. I mean, <laughs> I can't 
I'm just a sack. It's all right. You can come out now. Couldn't let you hold all the adventure, could I? <laughs> New jacket? Yep. Like it? Yeah. I like your sledge. It was my dad's. He used to do the Christmas deliveries every year. And now it's my turn. Wow. Why are we whispering? Look where we are. Mr. McGregor's garden. Come on. Uh. What are we doing here? Let's see what the old guy's up to. As long as he's not looking for a rabbit to put in a pie. Oh, ah! Bloomin' wheelbarrow. <laughs> Peter, let's get out of here. I mean, shouldn't we be getting to the shop? Shopping can wait. Now that we're outside, let's have some fun. <laughs> Trouble is, this time of year, we only ever get to eat cabbage. Cabbage soup. Cabbage casserole. Cabbage... <gasps> Radishes? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? If you're seeing a pile of the most sweet-smelling, mouth-watering, tasty radishes in the whole wide world, then yes, I am. Let's eat! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lily? This is wrong. Very wrong. Radishes don't just appear in the middle of the woods. And definitely not in winter. Something smells fishy. Mmm. Smells pretty radishy to me. Hey! Uh, uh. Think about it. Who would leave something like this out here? It has to be a trap. Tra trap Or maybe it's not a trap. Shame to waste all this yummy food. Um. He could be right, Lily. It's better to be safe than sorry. Uh, maybe Lily's right. We better leave them. Tell that to my tummy. <laughs> now that's the tastiest lunch I never had. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Peter, <laughs> if something seems too good to be true, it probably is. <laughs> I know, I know. You've told me a hundred times. Those radishes look so yummy. Mmm. Oh, shush! I'm not talking to you anymore. Must stop thinking about radishes. Must stop thinking about radishes. Must stop thinking about radishes. Here's the radish. Huh? What are you doing here? Um, just out for a little walk. Wait a second, what are you doing here? I couldn't stop thinking about those radishes. Me neither. Come on. <laughs> what, what was that? Lily! It was a trap. I knew it! Peter! It must be Mr Todd's trap. He's got to be on his way. We'd better do something fast. I hear the dinner bell. Somebody must have fallen into my trap. I wonder what I've caught today. A duck, a squirrel, or a rabbit? <laughs> Cottontail is ready for her nap, Peter. Me too. <laughs> Peter Rabbit. <laughs> Just kidding, Mum. <laughs> I know what to do. I'll be really quiet so Cottontail can sleep. And if she does wake up? Psh, huh, easy. I'll just play with her until you get back from the village. I told you, I'm the best babysitter ever. I don't think 
think it's a good idea to leave Cottontail with Peter. I agree with Flopsy. Why, thank you, Mopsy. Oh, girls, Cottontail will be fine with your brother. Won't she, Peter? Sure she will. Back in a bit. Come along, girls. Mother, are you sure? <sighs> Babysitting. It's easy. Beat up! Beat up! Guess what? Shh! You'll wake Cottontail. <laughs> Phew! That was close. Sorry, Peter, but we just had to tell you. The first icicles of winter on the trees. And you know what that means? The squirrels will be doing the big icicle jump. I know that for a fact. We have to see it. Nutkin's bound to try the craziest jump ever. Come on, let's go. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, but I can't. I, I promised Mum I'd look after Cottontail. I guess you're right. You should stay here with Cottontail. Come on, Lily. We don't want to miss it. Sorry, Peter. It's going to be amazing! Wait, you two. Mum said I had to watch Cottontail, but she never said exactly where. Huh? Let's hop to it! You sure this is a good idea, Peter? Sure, I'm sure. Quick, emergency lullaby. Go to sleep, little Barney, go to sleep. Let me try. Ahem. Go to sleep in your wagon. No. Shh. Benjamin, it's a lullaby. Baby carrot. <sighs> oh. Wow. Just look at all that snow. We should be outside playing. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, Flopsy. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't you rather stay cosy and warm by the fire, Peter? I guess. Did it! <laughs> oh dear. I should have collected more wood to last until the snow clears. There's just not enough here. Not enough? We're going to freeze! Uh... Yay! Freeze! <laughs> no, Cottontail, freezing is not good. But we won't freeze if we get more firewood. It's just going to be hard to find any when there's so much snow. I can do it! I know you can, Peter, but all the firewood will be buried. But if we don't find some, we'll freeze! Freeze not good! Please. I want to go. Hey, don't forget me. Very well. Come Just on. Be careful. It can't be that hard to find wood. None here. <laughs> Are you sure this is a good idea? <laughs> Benjamin? Without a fire, the burrow will get really cold. I know that for a fact. There has to be wood around here somewhere. Let's keep looking. Well, it's not much, but at least we won't freeze. Ready to go? Almost. <coughs> hey! <laughs> Snowball boys! <laughs> should really get the wood back to the burrow, Peter. You're right. Come on. <laughs> <Whoa. laughs> hey. Huh? Wait. Where did all our wood go? Maybe we're looking in the wrong place. Look. Paw prints. Or maybe... Fox prints. Hey, 
heading. <gasps> that way. To Mr Todd's lair. Do you think Mr Todd took our firewood? There's only one way to find out. Let's follow those paw prints. Oh, uh, I thought you might say that.